All right, what's going on? All right, we're getting ready to put the other side on. So we had to cut off these arms so that we can pull the mold off. And we're going to do silicone again, then a plaster mold, okay. backing. So silicone today? Silicone today. The slop. Yeah, she needs her arms back. I know, it looks kind of weird. Man, that's a great color. <laughs> What coat, coat is this? This is only number two. And you gotta do four? Mm-hmm. Good morning, this is vlog 438 and I'm sitting in the 1954 Cadillac. Gonna be going for a spin today. Got a few places that I want to go, just kind of cruise through Malibu. The weather has been spectacular, and these are the kind of days you want to drive a car like this. So, basically, that's what I'm going to do. Wheels and Waves, coming this weekend on Sunday. Check it out right there. Wait, let me get you closer. Later on, I'm headed down to Orange County. Going to be hanging out with the Orange County Mustang Club. Not going to be driving this car, going to be driving the Jeep right up there. But I'm going to hang out with them tonight, kind of check out and see what they're up to. Bunch of troublemakers. It's all good. Let's go. This car is one of many amazing examples from the Murphy Automotive Museum in Oxnard. Another one of my favorite museums. Although I just added another favorite museum, and that's the Metropolitan Pit Stop. Who thought you could have such a cool museum with only eight cars? Pretty cool. But the Murphy has about, um, I don't know, David, how many cars do you have? Put down in the show notes, how many cars are there? There's probably about 130 cars, something like that. Definitely worth seeing if you're traveling up in that area. amazing what Pepperdine has done. Big acknowledgments to them for putting up all these flags every September 11th. It's quite surreal just walking around here and understanding what they represent. And I'm so glad that they keep them up. Very cool. Good job Pepperdine. Driving around for the last hour, hour and a half. Just an amazing car, just to hang out and an incredible day. I'm headed to the Automobile Driving Museum because I'm picking up a just gorgeous 1966 Mustang Fastback and I'm going to be driving that out to Orange because I'm giving a talk tonight to the Orange County Mustang Club. So the Gracious Museum has offered to let me drive their 66 Mustang, a beautiful example of this car, and take it out to see these guys. Of course, I'd be happy driving a Peter Mustang too. It doesn't really matter to me. I just like driving.
Mustang time. It is Mustang time. It's going to be really big Mustang time. That's three carburetors. Three. I'm taking this beautiful 66 2 plus 2 from the Automobile Driving Museum down to Orange County for this talk. Love this car. On my way in this incredible Mustang. In the Jeep. I'm headed south. I've been in traffic for the past hour or so and I'm headed to a, a little pizza place in Orange County. I'm not even sure where it is exactly. Last time I was down here in orange in this circle, I was working on a film called Clock Stoppers. So that'll give you an idea how long ago that was. But now all I gotta do is find a parking space. Seems simple enough. I got here a little bit too early, but I did drive for a really long time because my phone died and I had to get a charger. It really sucks when your phone dies in a most inappropriate place. My plan was to get down here at two o'clock so I could shop. I've been here about a half an hour and now I gotta go. Pizza place is across town. Ken. Hey. We're at, where are we? We are in uh, Tustin. T we're in Tustin, not even in orange, kind of in orange. We're in Tustin and we're at Zita's? Tustin, Zita's Pizza. Zita's Pizza Zita's because, uh, well, um, we're just, we're going to be looking at Mustangs for a few minutes and then I'm going to go in and I'm going to give a talk. We're going to talk about the vlog, we're going to talk about Wilson Waves and that's about it. Yeah. Look at all these Mustangs. some nice cars. There's a 66 over there. There's a fastback over there. Got a few cool ones. actually the next day. I had a great time with the Mustang Club, although it really wasn't any an appropriate place to be able to film. It was kind of, you know, they, they were doing their club event and they had a lot of stuff going on and it wasn't really the best place to vlog from. It was kind of loud and we were all eating pizza and there was just all kinds of shenanigans, shenanigans going on. But I'm super grateful that they had me down there. I got a chance to talk for uh, quite a few minutes and, and uh, see some of those cars with Ken, which is very cool. Big thanks to Roddy and to jean de Chappelle for setting this up. Uh, we're going to be hanging out with those guys at the Cruising for a Cure that's coming up. Sorry, I had a lot of different shows going on. Not a bad day full of cars, you know, driving around that caddy, heading down and checking out some Mustangs, you know, just 
you know, every single day uh, in this town of cars is, is quite an extraordinary experience. You can't enjoy stuff like that if you're worrying about, you know, your bills or you're worrying about this or you're thinking about that, you know, uh, something you did yesterday or what's going to happen tomorrow. You got to stay present. And this is where the fun is. This is where the joy in life is. The joy is, is right here, right now, talking to you guys. But it's a pretty scary thought when you think about, you know, some people saying, well, they don't even remember driving from A to B. They were too busy thinking about stuff. There's a lot of people out there that are driving and they're not even in their cars. So staying present, that's what it's all about. Uh, yeah, you really get to enjoy things. Imagine surfing and, and, and thinking about something else while you're surfing. You'd be dead. Our power is the ability to focus on what we want and just go for it. And the only way you're going to do that is to stay present, to stay in the moment, and to think about what it is that you're trying to achieve. You can't let things pull you over this way or pull you over that way. If you go out and do something and it doesn't work out the way you think it's supposed to, let it go. Just know that something better is coming. Okay, that's it. That's all I have for today's vlog. Thanks for watching. We got some really cool stuff coming up. We got the Galpin event. We got the, uh, the JDM event at the ADM. The JDM at the ADM. I didn't make that up. And then Sunday, of course, Wilson Waves. Can't wait. It's going to be so cool. See you tomorrow.